Hey, what's up, YouTubers? Justin Defense here. I'm going to show you guys a video on how to make a floppy disk boot disk, and from there, I'll give you some pretty dangerous codes that can mess up a hard drive if you just want to screw around with the computer. I'm going to say this once. If you guys do mess up a hard drive, it's not my fault, so do this at your own discretion. All right, moving on. Put in a floppy disk, and once you do that, right-click on your floppy disk drive. Sorry, it's going slow right now. I'm just converting videos from my video camera to my computer. Oh, God. Tick, tock, tick, tock, tick, tock. I'll just pause the video. No, never mind. Okay. Okay, from here, you're going to go to Format. It's going to take a while, so wait a second here. I got that background from Digital Blasphemy, by the way. I like it. I like it. I like it. Oh, come on. Alright, there we go. And from here, this menu, you're going to go create an MS-DOS startup disk. And start. Alright, this is going to take a while, and after I do this, my floppy disk will be made, and I will have to enter it into my computer and do some steps from there. But I can't record it with Hypercam like I am now, so I'm going to change to my video camera. So if you do realize the difference in audio, video quality, whatever, it's because I'm going to be using my video camera. So, alright, yep, I'll see you on my video camera. See ya. Hey guys, Justin Defense here. I'm on the outside view of my computer, so yeah, this is what you're going to do from after you get the uh, floppy disk and the turned into a boot disk. Alright, by the way, if you ever hear a dog, that'd be Max. Max! Max! Hi, bud. Hi, hi. <laughs> Alright, so you're going to take your floppy disk, you insert it. I'm going to turn on your computer. Immediately come up to here. You're going to click F2. Let's click F2. It's going to start up. Sorry about the bad quality of the camera. I'm using a digital camera because my video camera actually won't properly download videos to my computer yet. So I'm going to need to buy a cable. Anyway. Pretty bad quality. I'm just going to try not to zoom and just zoom with my hand. Okay. Right off the bat, it says you're missing command.com. And that's because the way I showed you guys from just doing, um, just format, like right clicking and all that stuff, that doesn't give you some stuff like command.com. Now, if you want to do it a more complicating way, go to www.bootdisk.com. And then from there, you're going to pick an option that says turn a floppy disk, make a floppy disk boot disk. You click on that, you're going to download it onto your floppy disk. And then, yeah, you'll have that, which lets you do a bit more commands. Anyway, here's some commands I'm going to show you. First of all, it's going to be format. And when you're going to do format, it I think it brings you a menu. I'm not positive. But once you do format... Uh, it will format your computer, and that means you won't have any of the startup. You, but you can get to this, and if you do get to this, you can type unformat, and it will unformat your computer. So that's not that bad of one. There's also Dell Tree Star Oh Slash Y Star Dot Star. Now this. It's pretty bad code too. Okay. And the worst code of them all. I've tried this on one computer. Yeah, completely destroys it. It's called F disk. Right off the bat. Like you turn it on, it'll give you a little words and then tell you that it's not working. So F disk. F disk. If you ever want to mess up a computer, use that. Do this at your own discretion, though. It's not my fault if you do mess up a computer. 
It's out. Your opportunity. So, yeah. That's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.